Hi, everybody. Welcome to Clothing for All. Today's topic has to do with logos and logo designs for your event, your company, uh, your team. It's very easy to get your logos to us and to place them on what would be called a mock-up and that. So let's get into that. You got some of the key words there. Uh, let's we'll continue. Um, to most companies have a logo. Most individuals or, or teams rather have logos. And for them, it's a simple matter. The logo has been designed already. But you want to make sure that when you give it to the uh, screen printer, us, hopefully, that uh, we know exactly what you mean since we're not physically looking at each other across a, a business counter or some such, so that we know exactly what you mean by not just the size of the logo but the placement of it. So there's what uh, people would call a mock-up. Mock-ups are very easy for you to do so that uh, on our website you would go to screen printing or embroidery, click on either one, you'll get to a picture that has on the top of it, it says free designs online. And underneath that is a picture of a girl wearing a t-shirt and it says design your logo free. You would click on that, they would take you to a page called Logo Design Studio. In that studio, once it pops up, let's say uh, whatever kind of software it uses is pretty fancy, you would pick a garment or a towel or a bag. You may not find the same model number you're looking for, but that's okay. All you're trying to do is get a rough idea. You'll find a t-shirt or a long sleeve shirt or a jacket or some such. Then you grab, you upload your logo, place it where it needs to be, and you click on the appropriate button to send it to us. And at that point, we would have your logo and, knowing, and know exactly where it's supposed to be. So that's very good because a lot of people are asked for mock-ups and here you're saving all the data going back and forth and the delay. Uh, it's very easy to pop that up, give us your logo. We've got the mock-up that you did, very easy to do, and you're all set. In fact, uh, if I were to click here, I would sit there and you pick a product. You'd find, let's say, a T-shirt. Click on that. Pick the color of the shirt if you like. That way, you, you know, if the color is there, usually it is, or something close enough. And then once you pick that, you then uh, add text if you like. All kinds of fonts here uh, from uh, fourth and inches. Achilles all the way down to um, I can't even guess a, a bunch now you upload your art once your art's uploaded you then request a quote as soon as you click on and you might put down does these many this many shirts and sizes and all that you click uh, request a quote you're done you can also click uh, in sharing email print a PDF file also works on you can send this work to Facebook Twitter Buzz or MySpace, pretty thorough. But uh, the main thing that we're talking about right now is to get your logo in a location on a garment, front, back, side, sleeve, pocket, and then have that mock-up done so you won't be disappointed when your order is done. Let's go back to the bigger deal. Suppose you don't have a logo. Uh, you have an event, a birthday, bar mitzvah, wedding, uh, or it's a picnic for your company and you're doing something special. Well, there's many things that I'm reading from a list here of what customers ask for. They're looking for business or company logos. Um, they're looking for free design online. Ours is free. You don't have to make a purchase from us, but it won't send that art uh, to, uh, to you. Uh, but you'll have that picture and, and uh, you'll treasure it always, I'm sure. Uh, so it's a free logo design online. And uh, of course, you can design a corporate logo. Again, the logos are free. You design it yourself. You can grab things from, uh, from Microsoft Word. They have, a, they have all kinds of images that are available. Many of them are free. Some are at a discount. But you can, you can pay for the ones that are, that are not free and uh, take that and mix it so you have a royalty-free art so you don't get sued by someone for taking their logos. One thing we don't do is we won't take a logo that we believe to be copyrighted uh, and, and, and print for somebody. That's just, well, it's not legal. And we just don't do things like that. So that's a great graphic design center of ours called the Apparel Design Studio. There's even a demo on here you can click on. It shows you how to do it. It's really amazing. On the top right of that page, as you click on it, it runs a, um, I'm looking at it right now. You, you, you just click on the video <laughs> like we're doing here, and it describes how all that stuff works. It's really very cool. Um, 
What else do we need to know here? How to make a logo. Well, that shows you how to make it. That video will tell you everything you need to know to create one. Um, golly, I mean, that's really about it. Uh, the only thing about logos now is once you've done your logo, you want to tell us if it's to be screen printed or embroidered. Now, what's the difference? Embroidered logos, I would put on nicer apparel. The, um, the upside to that is it looks richer because you're actually adding more fabric to an area of the garment as you customize it. The uh, disadvantage relative to screen printing, uh, sorry but I have uh, allergies, is that it costs more. Now for us, a logo starts at $2.99 to embroider and they get you a 5,000 stitch logo or smaller uh, and only a $7.77 setup cards, cost, cost, I'm sorry. Whereas screen printing is 99 cents per color. But what you also have in screen printing is a $15 per color screen cost on each order, not per item. Uh, and every second color is 45 cents per item. Whereas you can put on, a, on an embroidered logo up to 12 colors and the price won't change a bit. There's 12 needles in the machine and they can load it with 12 different thread colors if that's the complexity of your logo. I hope I've answered that for you. Uh, once we've gotten your logo, we do reply within one business day uh, with a quote, and it's a good quote. You can take that one to the bank for at least a month. Um, and on digitizing for embroidery, we will, we will, at your request, once you've seen the price, we will digitize it, sew a sample, photograph it, and email it to you for your approval until you think you got it right. If you need to see the physical sample for a price, uh, $10, we'll mail it to you. Uh, we'll go priority mail. The, uh, uh, you, as far as screen printing goes, you get a mock-up because you made it or you had your graphics department make one and they sent it to us. They go, our logo goes there. We don't do mock-ups because it's really hard uh, f for us. Uh, well, I can't say it's hard for us, but it's better for you. If you give us that mock-up, we've given you the software, and then it's up to you to sit there and go, I want it there. And we have a picture of it. You have a picture of it. You made the picture. That's what you get. Uh, for us, we, we don't recreate the work that you did uh, because you already did a great job. It's your work. <laughs> so uh, thank you for listening to us at uh, clothingforall.com, and uh, hopefully we'll see your art or your request for a quote really soon.